Welcome to the Pacific Mountain Regional Council General Meeting 2020 taking place using the platform Whova. This tutorial we're going to look at voting and polling uh, on a mobile device. Uh, the tutorial is recorded using an Android device but is very similar um, using an iOS or an Apple device as well. And so throughout the meeting, uh, we will be uh, especially voting, but there may be other times that we ask for your opinion on things. And there's a few different ways uh, that you will get notifications, that you could get notifications of a poll. And one thing that often helps is to make sure you have notifications on your device on. Uh, so you do that by going up to the image of view up in the upper left-hand corner. Uh, you click on that. If you haven't added an image yet, it will likely have your initials up there. So you click that, and if you haven't added an image yet, this is a great opportunity to do so. Just makes it a little more obvious who you are so people can see you um, as they're looking through the attendee list and be, um, just makes it more friendly and easier to interact with folks. Uh, we're, this time, though, we're going to click on Settings. And in here at the top, it says Notification Settings. And you just want to make sure that you have the top two event notifications on and the allow notifications at the bottom on as well. And that just in, helps encourage uh, notification for the voting and polling. Now, it's not a perfect system. It doesn't always work. Uh, but you're much more likely to get uh, the notification if you have notifications turned on. So then I'm going to go and set, uh, start a poll, open a poll here. Um, I'm going to open the poll. And it can take a minute uh, for things to, to go through the system. Uh, and if you are in a session, say for example I'm in a session watching the live stream, um, when it works properly and the notification comes through, you'll get a notification and you swipe down and click the notification and you can enter the poll. That doesn't always work, unfortunately. And so then you'd need to use the arrow key to leave the meeting. And don't worry, we're going to take time as we do the, the voting in the meeting for you to do this. And you click back and you'll notice down here at the bottom right in messages, there's one activated. And so I'm going to click there and I can see up at the top a message that says polls from general meeting 2020. And if I go home, I can see that there's a polls option in the additional resources. And I'm on a tablet, so it's a wider list. On a phone, sometimes it's a vertical list here. But you can see it says polls as well. And when I click in there, it just takes me uh, to the various polls. And I can click answer the poll. So in this case, the question is, what is the meaning of life, the universe, and everything? And I can pick my answer, which clearly is 42, and submit. And we can see um, the results as of now of the polling. And so we'll also be posting the results during the meeting uh, with a real-time update. Polls are anonymous, so you don't need to worry about people tracking you later. And like I said, if I had gone into meeting um, and to the message, then it gives me the list of messages of polls um, and I can take the poll from there as well. And we also will be sending out emails. Uh, so if you've already participated on the poll within Whova, um, you don't need to respond within the email. If you do, uh, if you're not paying attention to Whova and you've uh, just kind of started your meeting and you can't find the poll, we will be sending out an email indication that there is a poll. Perhaps you're watching um, with somebody else in your household or your delegates from the church have gone to watch and you don't have Whova open with you, um, but you do have access to your email. You'll still be able to participate in the poll. You'll get an email with a link that you'll click and then you can, um, as long as you're logged into Whova, um, you can respond to the poll as well. So a few different options for doing so. Uh, just do one of them. Only one of them should work anyway, so it's not a big deal. Uh, but that's how you would do the polling. So on your mobile device, you'll have that option for polls once there's been a poll. Um, or you can go to messages and get the message about the poll and respond that way.